Hi my friend, today we model this part. It seems to be difficult but it is not at all. This is the drawing few dimensions so we can start. New standard millimeters IPT XY plane and we draw some lines. Horizontal, vertical, keep press the left button, go here and back to the start. We place this center on the center point, then this is 60, this radius is 50. Then other lines down keep press the left button go here keep press the left button go back here keep press the left button up and up here is not tangent mark we apply tangent we make equal this arc with this arc, this line, with this line. We place in the center, the center. Dimensions are 30 is this, 14 here, and 27.5. Now we have a fully constrained sketch, but we have to apply fillet of 14 to this corner and this corner. We also have to cut with split to cut that horizontal and we make this construction still fully constrained finish sketch extrude symmetrical on 50 Very nice. Back to the drawing and we see here radius 14 on both sides. Symmetrical, of course. Then uh, we apply shell with the thickness of 5 and the last is this hole at a distance of 14. Let's do all this. Select an edge 14 select also the other edge okay then shell of 5 millimeters we select this face to be not included okay then this face for a new sketch that sketch is a simple circle with diameter of 10 and distance of uh, 14 here. One dimension needed, vertical for this point 
and the center point. Where is the center point? The center point is here. Fully constrained. Finish sketch, extrude, cut all the way through the part. Okay. That's all. Let's see what is the volume. I properties, physical, update, copy, close, drawing, double click, and the new value is absolutely the same. Cancel. We use this existing uh, volume. Then we apply material, steel, carbon. We select the view. We apply shaded, simple shaded, and default lights instead of default IBL. That's all. You see, no difference between them. That's all for today. Thanks for watching. Bye-bye.